Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episodes one and two of Kuma 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 Bear. Okay, so, um, <laughs> this and the other show that officially will be coming out on Wednesday, um, were the two shows that at the time when they were airing, um, I really, really, really wanted to watch, but of course, you know, your girl was hella busy, you know, and... <laughs> Didn't have time because, you know, as the same person who was, like, obsessing over Kadaka and, you know, Akadama Drive and everything all like I normally do on a daily basis if you follow me on Twitter. Um, I think it was, what, Christmas uh, and finding out that this got a second season and the other show, I think, um, that I'm watching, I think, ended, I believe. I think so, yeah. But, um, funny enough. Yesterday or Friday, when you guys see this, I bought all four um, novels of these. I'm only on chapter seven, and it's really good. And I have been wanting to see. I was like, should I buy the series first and then watch it, or watch it and read it at the same time? And I was like, yeah, let's just go ahead and watch it at the same time and do that bullshit. But yeah. <laughs> Other than that, let's go ahead and get started on episode one in three, two, one. Hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm ready to see my cute baby, you know. Oh my god, like, uh. But damn, this is how we're starting it? Oh, uh, okay. Hmm? Now, is that Yuna running into the village? Or... Yeah, I think no. Cause that's not Fina. And nobody ain't gonna do shit, right? Oh, Elena! Well, that's fucked up. Isn't that, um... Oh, okay, no. You're... Mm, okay. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I got wrong. Helen, not Elena. My bad. I would have assumed that they would have started with her, you know, officially, you know, being welcomed into the world and then her going on an adventure, but... Okay. <laughs> Okay, hold up, kid. You, you kind of need to calm down. Um, honestly, she's OP. <laughs> mm. 
I mean, do we really have time for that, though? Well, yeah, because that's the only way that she's gonna, you know. She's so fucking cute. Oh my god! Well, kid, hold up. It's a little too dangerous. Why don't you just stay here? <laughs> Okay, well, Kai, I don't think I officially met you in the book, though, but, you know, hey, how you doing? Oh, that's so fucking cute. <laughs> Yeah. I mean, well, you know, pfft, um, she did beat the crap. Well, no, her and Fina beat the crap out of some wolves in like the first chapter, but. Pfft. God, they're so fucking cute. I can't. Patient kid, aren't you? Is the viper still here? <laughs> Oh, 
Yes, we know, and a silly, cute bear suit. You think she can't do anything, but she can. <laughs> Uh -huh. mm. Yeah, I mean, you know, she could probably defeat it like that, so... Because the fact is you didn't make as much noise as everyone else. Hmm? I get that, but you really haven't seen her in action though, but... <laughs> I mean, I think everybody would honestly could be like, what the fuck? <laughs> I mean, imagine a girl comes to your town just as a fucking, you know, bear. Cutesy, wootsy bear. What the? He'd be like, what the fuck is she about to do? She'll be okay. Underground. Mm, crash. Um, you know, girl don't like snakes. No, mm mm. Uh, a snake have to be a bastard i mean damn you can't go down because it's like thick skinned can I have this onesie like damn <laughs> it's either that or buy a monokuma one
hopefully that. Oh. Mm. -mm. I never would have thought in like the so many years that I've watched anime that we would have a girl in a bear outfit being OP as fuck. Because God was like, yeah, you like, mm -hmm, I like bears, so we're going to give you everything bears. I mean, between her and what's her face from like um, the average ability show, I mean, God. <laughs> That's it. Well, damn! I thought you, you know, like cut it and then you know go find Phoenix and, and you know sell it. But no, okay. <laughs> Uh, no, Kai, it's okay. She's already done. <laughs> oh, Kai. It was easy. It took like what? 10 seconds? 30 minutes? showed Helen but Fina I, and then you know you haven't showed that one the asshole you showed one of his followers but you haven't showed the asshole and I really need him to get his butt kicked I'm sorry I mean, the only thing that I can say is because they showed her laying down, would it be before, you know, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah. Oh.
so it just walks. Oh, okay, like, yeah, like a big-ass rooster, like the big-ass rooster from Little Witch Academia? Nah, it's okay. Sorry you defeated. <laughs> no, she actually did it. I mean, come on, guys. I know you guys aren't the best guild. Oh my god. <laughs> so yeah, you just logged in for the day basically. So you have she hasn't been set. Okay, there we go. Thank you. Cuz I figured So that's why she hasn't met Fina yet. Okay, alright, so I loved it. I just have a lot of questions because it's only, it's only read the first six chapters of this. I mean, you know, I was assuming that we would have got to the point where she filled out this questionnaire and everything and then boom, God was like, okay, we're going to be a brand new freaking character inside. <laughs> With, um abilities because we're not going to talk about the one where because like oh my god last night or really Friday night um in Barnes and Nobles and reading and getting to the oh my god where is it I gotta because this shit made me bust out <laughs> laughing I was like are you ever kidding me um let's see if this is why I hate having long nails right now they're bitches I think how do I No. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Fuck it. The bare underwear, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> I was like, wait, what? <laughs> I was like, I, <laughs> I wasn't expecting <laughs> I wasn't expecting to see, you know, the other the bears actually in this episode. I was like, oh, okay. I was like, baby, in like the next couple of weeks or something. I don't know because of course this is gonna take me six weeks to do this show because this is a twelve episode series and I'm doing it by two episodes. I I mean, but yeah, it was sweet. I I thought it would be like um, going back to the book again. There there's a moment where her avatar doesn't look like what she currently looks like right now she doesn't use um she created her own and such and so when she officially 
you know god sends her into the world and she looks what she looks like now so that's why i was like sitting here and i'm like wait i'm confused and then i was like oh okay now i got you but yeah it was cute i mean it just seemed like this first episode was a little filler base plus canon base at the same time because of the fact is um her in the stock market i thought that was a really interesting touch because out of all the things i was like yeah how the hell are you getting this money so quickly and of course she's talking about she feels like nobody cares about her and such and that's why she's really alone and she always wants to do um nothing but game i mean most of us gamers feel like that sometimes not all the time just some of us not me but yeah she's just adorable and okay i i didn't believe this when i looked at this cast so I was sitting here thinking <laughs> Yuna was being played by um Tomoyo Kurosawa was like her most recent role is um what the fuck is her name in freaking Laid Back Camp? Kirby's best friend in Laid Back Camp and then my personal favorite role besides um her Mich as Michelle and Benzity is freaking Swindle and Nakadama Drive. No, that's freaking Junko's VA from Zombieland Saga and it doesn't even sound like her. And when she talks using uh, in her possibly regular voice which is Yuna and then you know as Junko she uses a cute like high voice and I'm like what the fuck is this? I'm like oh my god <laughs> but she's so fucking cute like I really want that onesie. And, you know, because your girl has been looking on Amazon for the past, like, day looking for onesies. I can't find onesies, but, you know, that I'm lying, but, except the freaking Marie that I have in my freaking closet now. That, and then I've also found figures of her, and I love the white and the black one, and I don't know which one I want. Like, oh my fucking god, because they're just so effing cute. And I want it so bad. But yeah, I, I mean, for her first episode was good. I The funny thing is just to automatically know who she is coming in and seeing a little bit of the story before she essentially has to start all over again and eventually um, meet Fina and such. Because like, I was also expecting the wolf situation, how she meets her, um... Fina, you know, essentially being scared and being like, oh my god, are you gonna eat me? And you're like, no, I'm not gonna eat you. I'm still a human, even though I'm in a bear costume. But I do love the fact is that everybody is looking at her and I'm like, what the fuck is this girl here in a bear costume about to do? <laughs> because, like, I, I was like that too, because when I was in Barnes and Nobles last night and I, like, immediately see the cover, and mind you, I have the first four volumes of this, um, I see the cover and I'm like, what in the world is she going to do in this cute onesie with these like, <laughs> and then, you know, you you just read and you're like, oh, oh, okay. So yeah, thank God I didn't get spoiled on <laughs> like too, too much on this. But yeah, go ahead and pause the video and I'll see you guys in one second for episode two. Okay, episode two and three, two, one, go. I should have got fucking water. Damn it. Yeah, that happens, you know. Yeah, because that's originally her avatar. It's cute. Yeah! <laughs> Just need to answer some questions. Did they just show the bear underwear as well? Yeah, there's a man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> NLP item. <laughs> oh my god. Mm 
हैं Well, yeah, because that's about to be your permanent outfit, babe. <laughs> Poor babe, she didn't even know. I mean, oh my god. But yeah, it is cute! No, I want it so bad. Hell, I do want to ask more questions, but I think at the same time... I kind of should because I should just wait until I read because I think after I'm done watching this and the other show that I got to watch plus I got to watch Tropical Rouge Pretty Care because I'm currently waiting for that and who knows when the fuck that's gonna come out I mean honestly like it's now 10 24 at night and that is seen out and I'm like mmm I'm about to cry over these damn characters. It's only episode two, damn it. Mm, kinda. You can't exactly do that. You can, you know... No, babe. Oh. There's the wolf! I wonder if we're gonna meet What's-His-Face in this episode, too. I mean, it would make the most sense because he gets introduced in, like, the first few chapters as well. Well, that little stick ain't going to up, but... Mm. God damn, you know, like shit.
See, she's going to fall in love with her like Sire and Elaine. <laughs> it's Wandering Witch all over again. Uh, don't worry, she gonna do something. <laughs> Oh, okay. The thing that you use in episode one. Makes sense. Mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, don't worry. She has stuff with her. <laughs> She's okay. I mean, yeah, I understand, but so. You know. Yeah. Well, yes, honey, your outfit, baby. <laughs> Oh, 
so fucking sweet. Oh my god. <laughs> No, you're Elena, right? Yeah, still here. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. <laughs> I mean, you know, hey, at least you got to keep your money. You got a cute outfit and you got some money, so hey. That's a win in my book. Yeah, I can't even blinking as a bear. Oh my god. Oh. Yeah. Mm hmm. Of course. Damn. <laughs> Fina. Fina is now the new Latina. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. We protect the child. Mm hmm. Oh yeah, because I didn't do that part yet. There's the fuck. <laughs> I really don't like him. <laughs> like this afternoon, I wanted to like throw my book because I hate this dude so much. Oh, fuck you.
We get to do the crystal thing and everything? No? We skipping that part? Okay. <laughs> I mean, what else is she supposed to play? But wait, Yuna? <laughs> okay. I better see cosplays of this child. You know what? Hell, hell, I would love to cosplay as her. She's so fucking cute. <laughs> Is that just like a... Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, it kind of looks like Bob. It looks kind of almost like a Pokemon as well. Yeah. It, it looks like a, um, a Growlithe. Uh, Fina? Is it Fina? Fina! Oh my god! Oh. Mm. No, it's okay, but you can't come out here by yourself. Oh my god. You know, you'd be in a little party. Mm. 
Mm, good question. Mm, that too. And then it also seems like Yuna barely really has any friends. I mean, she said no one really cared about her, so... Why is she so cute? Oh my god! I can't! I'm like proud! So Look at her! Oh my god, she's so adorable! Oh my god, you want to protect her? Show how much! But, okay, so finally seeing Fina, Elena, um, Gents, that asshole, Debra, yeah, Debra, yeah, fuck him. Uh, nobody, I don't like him. I like, because I. Do not like him. <laughs> oh my god, I hate him so much. But, um, the fact that, you know, Yuna can hold her own, even against a, a, a tiger wolf, like, what the <laughs> I think it's just, you know, that OP-ish. I mean, you know, hey, whatever flows your phone and everything. But yeah, I mean, honestly, it, it seems like the relationship or the partnership of Fina and Yuna, Fina's gonna fall for her. I mean, because as I said, if you look at their relationship as such, it's very similar to Saya and Elena from Watering Witch and, and such. Even though hopefully we don't get an episode or a moment where they switch. <laughs> to like a freaky Friday-ish. I don't think that's gonna happen. I mean, okay, hold on. Let me try to get these books. Do I have all the books right now? Yeah, I do. Okay. So, as someone who has books three, four, two, three, and four, and looking at them, um, I'm guessing the blonde hair girl of novel three maybe will meet her next week. I don't know. And, and then... Who knows? I just... I have no idea. I... It, mm. Yeah, I got nothing. <laughs> I got nothing right now because anything could happen and I mean do I think I can finish this book tonight I could if I really wanted to really really wanted to because I really am enjoying this book even though I'm only on six you know it's chapter seven and I got like a long way to go but like this is a girl who read a damn book in a week and then another book in like 24 fucking hours being distracted with other things but still you know uh, yeah don't do that mm -hmm. and that, that was only because it was fucking twilight deja but you know hey yeah but you know it's cute and it's adorable just precious baby girl who just needs to be protected hopefully no one has lived this child or i will you know mm, yeah but <laughs> honestly i cannot wait to see what else is in store for these two eventually meeting the blonde girl and then anyone else who i haven't really personally met yet because book one and such um yeah i don't know what else to say about so i don't even know what else to say i i mean i i do have a question i wonder if um essentially Will we possibly get to see, like, a little more of Yuna's backstory, especially, you know, the situation of her parents, her grandma, uh, her grandpa, um, maybe before she officially quit school and such. Let's also thank God that, you know, Yuna didn't die by, like, or will, you know, get isekai by the typical norm, you know, like, you know, like Sakura, you know, walking out one day, like, hey, I'm gonna be an idol today, and then Chuck Coon comes and kills her. <laughs> you know, I mean... <laughs> Chuck Roo was just like, mm, not today, not today. <laughs> but, I mean, you know, it is what it is. I'm guessing, um, I don't know. <laughs> but, yeah, other than that, guys, that is my reaction to be towards episodes one 
and two of Kuma Kuma Bear. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join Master Squad. And of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Wednesday for episodes three and four. Bye, guys.